Welcome back to part two of Rekindle Your Curiosity, where I am trying to make a watering can. I'm starting with a pound of clay, which is what I use for my bed vases. The body of this is gonna be a basic shape, just a cylinder, but the top is where it's gonna get tricky. So what I had to spend a lot of time figuring out was what was the right size for where my thumb will seal up the top, and then what's a good shape for my fingers to wrap around. So I started with this first one, and then I made a couple more, just really working on the size of the hole, the placement of your thumb, um, where your fingers wrap around. After it dries, I clean up the bottom and then I'm ready to make the holes. The original picture that I was sent had these small squares. I have a small scalpel tool, but it really didn't make small holes and I'm not really happy with this. I'm going to try something else. I used my pin tool and that hole seemed too small, so I used this hole punch tool and that kind of seems too big. The holes will shrink a little bit in the kiln, but I'm still not sure about this. So I went back to the pin tool. I think these holes are going to be too small. I did add a bunch of holes just to see if I could get the water flow to work with this option. I'm not sure if any of these are going to work. Stay tuned for part three. 